Hey guys, it's me, it's KC, and welcome back to the Summer Events and Family Gather Quest for Stuff. We are following Peter Griffin, because we're about to start episode 3 in this major event. We've also got a timer on the side, you can see 16 hours and 55 minutes. That is a challenge from episode 2. So you know what, let's look at the challenge first. And we have to get 8 pranks done, and if you do, you'll get a bus. And these... Hold on, that's not it. Uh, that's not it either. And these, there we go. Are the challenges. So gone glamping, which I did in the first week. Still glamping. You get a glamping hot tub. I will probably not be able to get it. I don't know, but I don't really care too much about this stuff. Mainly because all this sort of stuff never really gives you characters. It's just decorations and stuff. But if you get all of them, you will get the luxury RV. Ah, okay, that's done. Where's Peter? I guess it doesn't matter. I'm reading you loud and clear. Producer Ben. Excuse me, I'm Ben, the theater arts producer from Camp Rising Star. Is there any way you'd hire me at your camp? Sure. It'd be nice to incorporate more of the performing arts at our camp. But why are you leaving Camp Rising Star? Would you say it's non-stop? Oh god, that's the name of one of the songs. You're one of them. I don't know what you're talking about. I've never seen the movie. Camp Rising Star is attacking. Defend Camp Griffin against Camp Rising Star. Plays Dan Studio with producer Ben. Who's producer Ben? No freaking way. I have to upgrade the campers to Beach Trick 1. It sounds pretty unpleasant if you ask me. But anyway, let's see. Camp Rising Star is attacking. So it says, they want to steal spotlight from Camp Griffin. Recruit stronger cannon leaders as the competition gets tougher, so basically like the previous weeks. And Camp Firewood and Belly Flop still attack, so keep at the ready. That doesn't sound pleasant either. Defend Camp Griffin against Camp Rising Star. Alrighty. Let's see how this works. So. We've got a whole bunch of campers, three of them are locked. Or, yeah, I guess three of them are locked for the new week anyway. But we can still use the ones from the previous weeks, which are good. Well, let's give this a shot. Remember that it says we just have to defend it, we don't have to win. Keep that in mind. I don't think this is gonna go the, the best, but we'll, we'll give it a shot. Purposely knew this was gonna pop up again, so I started saving my water balloons. And we'll also drop firewood, more care packages, I don't know what I'm looking at, it's too tiny, it looks like a store, or a piano, I don't know. And a VHS tape. Let's do it! Come on, come on, come on, bring it! Oh god, it's one of them! Come on, come on, come on! Kick punch! Use all your might! Hang in there, you graceful gazelle! Did I win? I did it! Hooray for me! Oh, it is a piano, I think. Alright, that's cool. Hooray! Good for me! We gotta upgrade the campers to Beach Street 4! On to place the dance studio with Ben, which means we can now look at the, the inventory. Let's see what we got. Alrighty, so we got Playwright Stewie. I can't type or spell. Is it... can I... should I? It is a premium character. We've also got Camp Griffin Directions Post. And as we keep going down the list, we've got Crystal Lakeside Cottage, Performing Arts Stage, which drops, looks like it might be some kind of playbook or a play script, I guess. Balloons, Camp Showers. We talked about placing down Producer Ben, so I'm assuming that's here somewhere. Hopefully. Tie-Dye Station. Wild Brian. Oh my god. Hi, you. You are definitely a wild... Uh, well, I was gonna say man. Dog. Wild dog. 
Still working on Great Outdoors Joe from the previous week. Oh, that poor horse. Hey, there's Counselor Andy, but where is this producer Ben that they speak of? Hello? Oh, it's in there! I still need more firewood. Well, that's not gonna work, is it? That is not gonna work. Oh, you know what? There's a new button down below. It says Camp Wars. That was not there before in the previous weeks. So, this is a way, I guess, of going to the characters, maybe? Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay. Still need to get that. And that as well. Okay. So the only way to get those is to actually take these new packages, which is the third category, four and a half hours. And do that. I accidentally double tapped it, didn't I? Alrighty. So I finally have enough of the firewood. Let's place this down. And it is not time, by the way, either. So that is good. Comes with a dance studio. There we go. We'll place this right here. And question pop up. Thanks for hiring me, Peter. I look forward to helping you with your camp's theater productions. No problem. I have to confess, when I saw your pastel shirts and shorts, I thought you were Jordan Almond, but I'm still happy to have you here. You're Susie, camp musical director and choreographer. Are you here to join Camp Griffin with Ben? Yeah, I quit. Camp Rising Star and cancel the musical. Plus, Ben and I go everywhere together. Really? Even, like, to the bathroom? Especially the bathroom. Camp bathrooms are kinda nasty. You have to hold me so I don't sit on strangers' pubes. That... I don't know what to say to that. So check out the Achievement Grand Prize. And at the bottom it says, Repair the Fire Pit to Find Director Susie. I don't know if that is timed or not. But I get the feeling it might be, because we've got the producer dude, or whatever, whoever we just put down a second ago. Then we've got that Brian skin that we haven't even looked at yet. And then we've got director Susie. So one of those have got to be timed. I'm assuming this one is going to be, but I have to go check. Yep, it's timed. Oh, it's dreadfully timed. So what that means is once you repair it and put it down, it will be a seven day timer. It will start. I recommend actually... Like usual, if you know it's timed, try to get all the different items you need first. That way, even though you won't be able to get the drops yet, you'll at least have them down, ready to go, so you can start it once you want to. Now, let's look at this character. Who does not seem to have a voice yet. But we got the VHS tapes. Come on. Workout tapes. They are always, which is fantastic, get from the Camp Wars. Clear streak 10 to earn all required. That is good to know. So once you get to streak 10 of the camp boys, you get all the tapes. We got obviously a microphone. Microphone stand. Get from camp radio station in the mess hall. All right. So definitely going to have that. I said this was a play or a script. It is a script. 17 uncommon. Quagmire. Crystal Lakeside Cottage. And Performing Arts Stage. Those are dance shoes? Yeah, oh boy, I know my theater. Make Herbert Shuffle Dance, get from the dance studio, which is this particular thing that we just put down. And I don't know, a magic eye? I don't know, wallpaper? Sequins! Boy, I wasn't even close. Camp showers in the mess hall. So there's at least a couple of the items here that we're going to have to get items for, unfortunately. But it's not timed. Director Susie is timed. Remember that. I did say there was another character. Right there, Wild Brian. And I've been peeing outside for years. What is this? That is, you haven't unlocked it yet. Keep finishing quest to find it soon. Well, chances are I'm going to have to get past the main quest line, which is this, here. But, I mean, I'm going to have to repair the thing to start the timer, and I don't want to do that yet. So, I'm assuming that the, the Brian skin may have achievements, because it says check out achievements grand prize. And when we go to it, oh, here we go. So, definitely this. Okay. Claim. This might take a while. Claim. 
There we go. Got three of them there. And... There's another one. So, so far we got a whole bunch now to work towards. We've got Clear Streak 2 from the top. Kid Quagmire, try it for the play one time. Unlock the jock. Alright, that sounds pretty... Pretty simple to do. Defeat rival campers 10 times, 50 times? Oh, kidney gravies. So this is the Wild Brian character. This is Grand Outdoors Joe. I am so close to getting this. I think I'm at... 116 of 129 if I recall. Let's just actually double check that. I am at, yeah, 116 of 129. So I'm doing really, really good. I just have to get the couple more. Let me just go back to it for a second. We have to unwrap 14 care packages, place a go-kart track. Wait a second. 7 plus 5 is 12. 116 and 129 is 13. Wonderful. Isn't that just wonderful? So I won't be able to get in these two achievements. I thought I was going to be able to, but no. This will add to 12. I need 13. There's one more to go, I guess. Probably another building or some dumb thing. I don't know. <sighs> and I don't have any of the wood either. I'm gonna stop it here, so keep it locked here for whenever I'm able to unlock next. Probably gonna be Great Outdoors Joe, because I'm super close with that. And then eventually I'll do all the other characters as well. So, as I said, a lot to keep us pity, and I guess we'll see what happens. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, and share. Thanks for watching. My name is Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, guys.